what on earth is a collaboration? The internet seems to be pretty certain about what a collaboration is. A YouTube collaboration is any collaborative effort made by two or more vloggers on YouTube to gain more exposure and grow their audience by working together. So it's basically cross-selling from one channel to the other. That doesn't seem like an artistic goal. I'm wondering why collaborations are so important on YouTube, mainly because I work in theatres. Collaboration is the architecture of what we do. There is a director or choreographer, there's a musical director, there's a stage designer, a costume designer and there's a video designer. And then there is many, many people on stage and backstage who collaborate to create a piece of art that can be presented to an audience. I'm not really sure if I'm getting this whole collaboration thing right, but if it's only about cross-selling from one channel to the other, I feel it's a bit shallow. For artists, it's pretty difficult to work together. Normally, you have your style and you want to work with your style on your style. The style of a visual artist is a combination of many things. Certain things like composition, coloring, the language you choose, all that makes your style. And it's important to investigate what those components of your style are, so that in case of a collaboration, you can give up or tone down on certain elements of the style without losing your artistic personality. And that's why I would encourage all you YouTubers to do more collaborations that result in a new style, something combined. Put together the forces of many creatives to create something new, sparkling, fresh. You have to be pretty certain about what is important about your style. Is it your storytelling? Is it your cuts? And uh, bring that into the collaboration. That's the only way the collaboration will actually... Hmm, went too far. Just two meters too far. Now there's noise. That's the only way the collaboration will actually profitize from you being part of the collaboration. Otherwise, it's just um, many films in parallel. Basically, collaborating is cross-selling. <laughs> cross-selling on the purpose of uh, furthering your channel. So it's like me putting a cute girl or a cute dog or both in my <laughs> vlog. Just, just to have a nice, just for the thumbnail. We're gonna put a cute girl and a cute dog on the thumbnail into the vlog, just to see if cross-selling helps. We're collaborating with... Um, what's Coco. 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 We're collaborating with Coco. I will, I will link Coco's Instagram below. Please follow Coco on Instagram. Oh, please, yes. <laughs> because this is a collaboration, you know? Yeah. Such a cute collaborator. Hello. Hello, my dear. Follow Coco on Patati2016. Yes. At Patati2016 on Instagram. <laughs> Can we do that again? Boom, boom, boom. <laughs> if, if that isn't worth following my new collaborator. <laughs> so basically now after collaborating we will share the links on our YouTubes and Instagrams and then our channels will raise in uh, awareness. Yeah. This is the concept of a YouTube collaboration. The problem with those collaborations is if you're not a dog, you're not really, really getting more value from our collaboration. But it's still fun. Don't get me wrong, I love it when your creators are putting your forces together and creating new stuff in a collaboration. I also think sometimes the result of those collaborations is a stunning artistic work where you can't distinguish the influences that one creator had on the other. A collaboration has to be more than just the sum of its parts. So if one and one makes three, then a collaboration was truly successful. I'm talking about those famous collaborations like Peter and Maddie 
where you really can't tell who influences whom, but the result is outstanding on both channels. The same goes for that incredible collaboration between Casey Neistat and Droneworks, where they added their incredible drone abilities to what Casey Neistat already does as a great filmmaker. Well, enough of that collaboration talk. Um, let's go inside and do some work, some proper work, something that I get paid for. Also, I just needed a reason to talk into a camera, so I have an option to turn around and look at this Zeppelin here. Actually, uh, technically it's a blimp. And it's gone. Blah, 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 blah.